don't forget to subscribe and turn on notification okay guys how are you doing i hope you're doing well welcome to youtube channel in this tutorial we are going to learn osr optical character recognition in python whereby we are going to learn how we can convert scanned pdf into editable or searchable pdf right we'll do two method number one will create a python function which will help us to convert scanned pdf to searchable pdf number two will do by using terminal will do it by using command on cmd but before we go on let me tell you some requirement for you to call out this task right so here is about three important requirements which are osr my pdf so you need to install this package if it, it it is not present in your computer but also you need to install camelot hyphen py but also you need to install ghost script whenever you get some error make sure you add this additional requirement which is pillow and the pythoseract i have a tutorial on how you can install pythoseract in a window and this tutorial um teaching specifically in a window on how you can uh, you can convert scanned pdf to searchable pdf in osr in python right so make sure all of these three important requirements are installed in your computer right but you after downloading ghost script and installing in your window machine make sure you add the ghost script in environment variable i'll be all the video description i'll put the link on where you can download the ghost script but let me show you how did i add it how did i add uh or how do we add the ghost script in windows environment variable right let me show you something here so you can see this is ghost script added in windows environment variable let me show you the installation folder here is where ghost script is installed but also here ghost script is installed so what you need to do after installing ghost script make sure you add bin in windows environment variable so click copy the path and add it in environment variable after that go to lib copy the path and add it in windows environment variable after that i hope after installing these important packages which is osr my pdf camel hyphen py and a ghost script your program will be okay so let's start with number one method of converting scanned pdf to editable or searchable pdf in python osr i'm going to use windows cmd that is command based method so after after successful installation of osr my pdf camelot hyphen py and ghost script you'll be able to learn osr command on windows cmd right here i can do something like this so this command is recognized in windows cmd because it is installed so if you want to convert this kind of pdf to searchable or editable pdf in python osr we're going to use this command right so os osr my pdf i like one option which is skip text right so whenever osr is making conversion of a scanned pdf and it finds a full text pdf it is skip right this is very critical because unless otherwise your program will terminate with error so here i put skip test means skip test skip text means that whenever osr find a page which is already in editable which is full text pdf it is skip so here osr my pdf uh, double hyphen skip test then it file you want to I mean input pdf file which is scandy dot pdf and i'm going to show you this before we make conversion then scandy to dot pdf so before i learn this command let me show you oh, okay let me just learn this i press enter so as conversion can start converting scandy pdf to full text pdf in python osr 
right it takes some few minutes some few seconds okay we are done so i come back here in osl folder let me show you this is the scanned pdf right which was my input file and once i try to highlight you can see i can't highlight i can't search right it is unsearchable we everybody know that always scan the pdf is unsearchable As here you can see i cannot search but after using osr my pdf to convert it into full text or editable pdf you can see i can highlight right i can copy but also i can search you can see i can search so this is the first way on how we can convert a scanned pdf to editable or full text pdf by using osr my pdf by using terminal so after that after learning the first method we are going also to create a python function we everybody know that possible your task will be you'll need to create a function python function which will uh, which will be revoking it whenever you need it to convert a scanned pdf to full text or editable pdf so here i'm going to create a python function i'm using anaconda and this is jupyter notebook but you can use PyCharm, visual studio code whatever right so here i'm going to create a python function for converting scanned pdf into editable pdf right so before before anything i need to import osr my pdf after that then i create a function with name osr then i put a bracket this function take two parameter which is file path and the file file input file which is the file path and output file which is the self path okay i hope we are together and no one is ragging behind after that what i'm going to do is osr my pdf my pdf dot osr i put a bracket right then inside i path file file path okay then save path i end i i, I conclude with um the, the i told you skip skip text is one of essential argument to path in when dealing with osr because once it find a page which is already editable or searchable it just skip but if you don't put this argument skip text whenever it find uh, editable pdf or searchable pdf your, your program will end up terminating with an error right so this is our function so what i can do here is uh, i'm going to learn this cell i hope this is okay what's what's wrong the keyword cannot be expressed so self path this is let me see what's wrong this is skip text skip text is equal to true here it is file path and self path okay let me see skip okay let me let me check out this python osr motec osr so skip text oh my god okay guys so here we need to put skip underscore and not hyphen taxi then i run this cell i hope everything is okay right so skip taxi is equal to true no modules named osr my pdf is true then i run this 
I hope this is okay. So after creating a function, now it's a time to revoke a function. So SL, I put a bracket. Then after inside of this function, I want to put, I mean, I want to put input PDF file, which is scanned PDF. Then in the output file, which is scanned tool.pdf. After that, I run this cell, right? So now you can see the conversion has started. Oh my God. So here I, I need to put scan D3. Scan D3. So let me. Okay. So let's let conversion start. And after some few seconds, you can see our program is successful complete. Once I come here and find Scandi, I find Scandi 3. Okay. Let me come here. Let me refresh. I'm looking for Scandi 3. Let me learn this once again. Let me learn this. So the conversion is in process. Then let me get back here. Find this candy. I don't see candy three. Let me delete this. Okay. So let me put this candy two. Then run this. Okay, guys, let me find this candy three. What's wrong? Python OSL AI. Oh my God. This is the path here. So this is a scandy two. This is a scandy three. So once I click here and I, once I try to highlight, you can see I can highlight, but also if I want to search i can search it so we, we everybody know that full text pdf is editable and searchable so this is how you can convert scan the pdf into editable or searchable pdf in osr in python this is optical character recognition thanks i hope you have enjoyed the tutorial never mind about the installation of requirement check out below video description I have put a link for downloading Ghost script and I've actually I've instructed you that after installation of Ghost script make sure you add bin and a lib in Windows environment variable. Also make sure you have installed the OSR my PDF and camelot-py. Our tutorial had two almost two section. First section we converted the scanned PDF to full text PDF by using command by using CMD. But the second method we created the Python function and we revoked it by putting some input which was input file pdf file to be converted into editable and output file a file to be saved after osr conversion thanks for watching i hope you have enjoyed it don't forget to like put comment share and subscribe for the next tutorial update thank you and see you in the next tutorials don't forget to subscribe and turn on notifications